That's why people are using this one simple step to hack your blood sugar after meals. Hi, my name is Troy. I've been in the health and supplement industry for over 16 years, and here's your daily dose of science. We all know that your blood sugar spikes after a meal. That's just part of how your body works. You blood sugar spikes, you have insulin, it goes and takes those nutrients to the blood. But according to neuroscientists Andrew Huberman and Dr. Casey Means, there's a simple and more powerful trick to kind of regulate your blood sugar, and it's as easy as a walk in the park. It actually is a walk in the park. New research shows that just a five to 10 minute walk post eating can dramatically reduce your blood sugar spikes. And we all know if you spike your blood sugar and it comes back down, spikes up, comes back down, that's not the best way to kind of take care of your health. Actually having a normal blood sugar that when you eat, your insulin kicks in and it goes back down. As a diabetic, I understand this completely, but this new research shows that just a five to 10 minute walk, just a walk around the block, significantly reduces that blood sugar spike so that you can kind of process those sugars and those nutrients a lot better. And here's how it works. After a meal, your blood sugar rises, but if you move, a light stroll around the park or around the house, around the neighborhood, invite a family member, make it a social thing, help your muscles soak up that glucose like a sponge, keeping your level stable. So it's not like it's just coming out and you're ruining your blood sugar and the nutrients that you got from your food. It's actually helping your muscles absorb that a little bit better. Huberman said, Says the sweet spot, start walking about 15 minutes after eating. So don't throw it on the fork and go out, but wait 15 minutes. For those with diabetes, like me, wait 30 minutes because that we have to process that blood sugar a little bit slower. So that's why there's no gym equipment, no weird supplements, nothing that you're taking, no vitamins or minerals are going to help this. It's just a simple walk around the block, five to 10 minutes, 15 to 30 minutes after you eat. And that's it. It's one of the simplest hacks out there to kind of control your blood sugar. Whereas as we know nowadays, every food we eat is full of sugar, high fructose corn syrup, all that kind of stuff. So to kind of combat that and compact your carb intake, just go for that small little walk. And this simple hack is going to change the way you feel after a meal. So instead of hitting the couch, get up and take a walk.